YouTube. How are we this evening? Well, we got that cedar uh, tree done as you've seen before dark, which was nice. It's just starting to get there now. What a nice climb that was. Very enjoyable. Um, I think it was... I'm going to get a little sappy. I'm going to get a little sappy on you for a minute here. It was about 20 years ago, close to it. I, uh, I wasn't having a good time in life. Just, just wasn't having a good time. Uh, by my own choice. Don't get me wrong. This ain't the blame game. They were my choices. But I wasn't having a good time. Um, and then I decided to start having a good time. And I guess what I'm trying to allude to, that's a big word, allude, is that I guess there was things I thought about doing for a long time and, and just didn't do them. I didn't, I, I was afraid. I, I was afraid to do it. Uh, uh, afraid of the unknown, really. Afraid of of failing, of, of maybe afraid of success, but I don't think so. I don't think it was, you know, people say, are you afraid of success? I don't think I was. I could have been, but I don't think so. I think I was afraid to fail uh, and afraid of a bunch of other stuff, which by the way, 99% of that stuff don't come true. It just don't. So, um, but I made a major change in my life and decided to quit my job and uh, do what was in me, inside me, that I wanted to do. And it was a difficult choice, but I did it, and I'll tell you something right now, it was the best thing, one of the best things, besides that other decision I made previous, that I ever did. Because I get to do what I want so like when I'm in the trees and you see me blabbering on about all the stuff in the trees and that and how I'm usually like you can see my teeth because I'm smiling that's genuine I'm not putting on a show I'm having a freaking blast up there now that to me is working I'm at work I'm having fun I'm working for myself. So anyways, regardless, I, I'm not saying this to say, yay, hey, way to go, Billy Ray. I'm saying it so if there's anybody out there right now and they're thinking, I'm, I'm, I'm unhappy at my job, um, you feel trapped, I'm telling you. It, listen, it, 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 if you're 80 years old even 60, 70, even 50 and saying, I should have done that when I was 25 or 26 or 27 or 30 or 19 or 15. If you say that, you're not gonna be a happy person. So, I'm just telling you, it took me till I was about 27 years old to figure that part out. And thank gosh, I did. Um, so, if there's anybody out there watching this right now, watching this guy ramble on about this, um, make that choice. Say, you know what? I'm going to do it. I'm going to go do whatever it is. It could be music. It could be job. It could be, it could be anything you, you think about doing all the time, but you just don't do it. And your self-esteem suffers because of it. Because you keep putting these thoughts in your head why you shouldn't do it. It's fear. F-E-A-R. It's fantasy. What's to be afraid of? Plus, even if you did fail, it was supposed to be that way. Because it wasn't the right thing to do. Well, now I'm getting goofy. Anyways, <laughs> I'm just saying. I, I, all I have is my experience. I, that's all I have. I can't tell you what to do. I won't tell you what to do, because nobody listens anyways. I didn't. I didn't listen to anybody. I didn't. I'll tell you right now, I didn't. I, 
had to learn by my own mistakes or my own experience let's say not mistakes experience so but I chose to do my own thing many years ago and I, I needed to live on a power saw that's what I wanted to do I wanted to work hard make a decent wage you know and uh, and, and I didn't know I was gonna have two beautiful kids and a, and a wife. I knew I was gonna have a gal. Always like having a gal. My wife is just my best friend, it's awesome. But I got two beautiful kids and I, and I run this fucking Billy Ray Street service in my hometown and we do okay, you know. Um, but the bottom line is, this may sound funny, but this is my life. This is my life. This is this is my place. It's a God-given right to do whatever I want to do with it. Anything. I chose to have children. I chose to buy a house. I have to pay for those things. So I enjoy to work. I like to work. I didn't stay in school. So I knew that I'd be laboring. So Anyways, I, I'm kind of rambling on here, but the gist of this whole chat or rant or whatever it is, the gist of it is, is that don't let fear stop you from doing the things you want to do. Just do them. Call it living your dreams or whatever. Just call it it. Do whatever the hell you want to do. Do it. Did I say do it? Because if I didn't, do it. Man, I, I can't stress that enough. God. I know it's scary. You got kids. You got these things. You got bills to pay. I know. I know. Trust me. I know. Anyway, that's about it. <laughs> tonight that cedar tree I was having a blast in it it's awesome just an incredible climb it's a nice nice climb I know I'm doing what I'm supposed to be doing right now I know it I feel it YouTube whoever's out there watching this thank you if you're watching and you're enjoying it good on you if you're not then you're not watching Cheers. And uh, subscribe if you're having a good time. Don't if you're not. But do me a favor. Do yourself a favor. If you've been thinking about doing something for a long time and you just haven't done it yet because of some strange reasons, do it. Just do it. Believe me, you will not regret it. Over and out, fucking Billy Ray. I'm going home to sit by the wood stove and have a nice half hot chocolate, half coffee with a single cream and see my wife and kids. We live to fight another day. Over and out, see you in the trees.